my name is Lisa Marie and I'm an artistic educator. And today we're gonna be showing you Pravana's shadow root technique. And I'm so excited to show you guys what we have in store today. Hi, my name is Lacey Walker and I'm super excited to see what they're gonna do with my hair today. So when it comes to traditional shadow root application, some of you might go in there with a horizontal section or possibly a diagonal back sectioning. What's unique about Pravana's shadow root application is we do a vertical application that goes with the natural shape of the head, creating a lot of depth and dimension. First, we're gonna find the client's highest point of the head. So you could see with Lacey, it's right about here. Once you find the highest point of the head or the apex of the head, we're gonna go about an inch to two inches right behind. So this is gonna be our main point and all of our sectionings will start right about here, okay? So the first thing is starting your section right behind the ear. We're gonna do a diagonal forward sectioning. So working from our point A right here, we're gonna create pie shape. So it's gonna go smaller from this point into a larger section down here and we're gonna be creating triangles along the scalp up into her hairline. And now when it comes to the back, we're gonna still take the same sectioning, but our sections are gonna get a little bit longer. Still keeping small from here, point A, and getting larger down here, creating a pie shape. <laughs> So now that our sections are all done, it's time to formulate. Grandmother Willow. A crew. So when it comes to this application, I really want you to let your creativity flow. So what we're gonna do is apply our first section. So like I said, we're gonna drag a little bit towards the crown. And as we get a little bit closer, just around this hairline, we're gonna just go to about a half of an inch up into an inch and a half to two inches towards the back. So keep in mind, we're going to that high shaping, going a little bit wider here into a smaller section, right at our A section. Make sure we're getting that hairline. As you can see with this section, as we start parting it, there's different points of the drag or the shadow root. So have fun with it. Not all of them have to be the exact length. You could go from here longer into um, a shorter application or each section you could drag down to two inches really customizable so you guys could see the different directions. So in the back, instead of going on the same section to a smaller application to a wider one, it is gonna be the same depth on each subsection from the crown down to the hairline, neckline. <laughs> All right, guys, we're all done with our technique. As you could see, this is a great foundation for a color mount, or this is a great way to blend old highlights for new growth.